It's time to take off your clothes, enjoy clothes free living, and join us for Naked, Nudist, and Naturist. Welcome to Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, the show that celebrates clothes free living for all. I'm your host, Frank Stone. And I'm your correspondent, Lisa Monroe, and I'll be reporting on all things within the Naturist community. So it's time to get naked and join us. And enjoy clothes free living on Naked, Nudist, and Naturists. Well, greetings and welcome into Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, episode 59 today. We thank you for being with us. We've been waiting all week for this moment, and here we are enjoying clothes free living for all of the right reasons together for the next hour. And now let's get to my brief interview with President-elect, soon-to-be President of the American Association for Nude Recreation, the terrific Linda Weber. One of them that I'm very excited about is the Young Adult and Diversity Advisory Council. And what that will do is it will be uh, populated by younger people and it will give me the ideas that they want to do. I don't know what younger people want to do because I'm not their age. And so <laughs> I don't want to, you know, pretend that I do. I think that's, you know, rather offensive, quite frankly. So it's going to be populated with younger people people, diverse people, and they will let me know what is um, important to them, how they nude recreate. So I am very excited. I had people uh, stepping up saying, I would like to be on that council. So that let me know that their voices wanted to be heard. And that's, I think, a big thing. They wanted to be heard. And now they have the forum to do that. And they're excited, which makes me excited, because I think that that's going to translate into success for us in getting the uh, marginalized communities that I think that we've kind have missed. You are listening to Naked Nudist and Nature's episode 59 today, and it could just be me. I'm not sure. But do you hear music in the background? I think I do. It's sneaking up on us ever so slightly because it's time for the one, the only, the terrifically over the top, our naturism correspondent, Lisa Monroe. Being a shirtless man, what if he had taken his shirt off while watching the movie, he asked. Well, I'm guessing he that would have been addressed as well. What do you think? I think he'd probably be escorted out of the theater <laughs> and considered to be some sort of, you know, yeah. someone coming in for different purposes into the theater. So yeah. it's just, it's ridiculous. We have such, we have created such a low threshold for change and for, and, and a bar for decency that it's really hard to get people to understand there's nothing wrong with this. I know. And I'm with him. I'm shoeless a lot, too. Wore yeah. heels far too many years. <laughs> Don't want to ever see a pair again. All right, Lisa, we have to get out of here, but we will do this again next week. Go out there and have a terrifically clothes-free week, and we'll see you next time. You too, Frank. Have a wonderful week, uh, shirtless and beyond. All right. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Again, you are listening to Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, episode 59 today. And now let's get to part one of my interview with the very terrific Karana Crozy. She is the current chairperson for the PR Committee for the American Association for Nude Recreation. Part one with the terrific Rana Crozy. We have many reasons for the attitudes that we develop. Uh, yeah. Some come from the society we live in. Some come from the religion that we we um, follow, we've created these, these rules of conduct. And so it's very difficult to change the way that we've been brought up to believe until we discover a better way of life. So the bottom line here is we need to raise our children differently. We need to, again, spread the word. The more people who understand what we're not, because it's yeah. this association. If you're nude, it means sex. Yeah. Well, that's not the truth. Right. I mean, we are nude when we go in the shower. Right. You know, we're nude before we get dressed. That's not sex. That yeah. is life. That's how we live. So yeah. when we can disassociate, you know, the whole notion that people of all ages and of, of various genders and can live together without their clothing on and engage in normal activities, whether it's cleaning your house or sweeping your yard or, you know, going out to play shuffleboard, et cetera. When we can 
have that idea that we can do everything without clothing that we can with clothing. The terrific Rana Crozy, the current chairperson for the PR Committee for the American Association for Nude Recreation. And next week on Episode 60, Part 2 of my interview with Rana Crozy. Well, you've been listening to Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, Episode 59 today. We give you a brand new show every Saturday morning at 6 o'clock a.m. Eastern Time. Continue to join us. Check us out on our website, nakednudistandnaturist.com, Spotify, Google, Amazon slash Audible, Apple Podcasts, and also on Twitter. You can write us anywhere, anytime, anyplace. And uh, we thank you for being with us uh, today. Plan to join us for every single one of our shows here and have your clothes off when you're listening. We have our clothes off when we're broadcasting, enjoying the naturist life. We celebrate clothes-free living for all. Remember to enjoy being naked and join us again for Naked Nudist and Naturist. We drop a brand new show every Saturday morning, so come back and join us. Have your clothes off when you do for Naked, Nudist, and Naturist. Have a great clothes-free day. 